I need to address this in video form because I'm getting quite a few comments about it and people are feeling the same way and I'm getting people asking about this update. I'm getting people asking about this feature. Um, what do I feel or where is the game? You th do you think it's going? Uh, and what's your honest thoughts on it? And am I going to play it anytime soon? Am I going to continue any of the videos I've done it in the past? And my answer is, I don't know. Because I honestly don't know where Tectonica is going. I'm kind of holding back right now. Um, as you know, I was big hype for the game when it was kind of announced last, not two years ago. Because I was speaking to Joey, the community manager at the time. And I was like, please delay it. I want to, you know, get back for it. But I, was, I don't release it whilst I'm at TwitchCon Amsterdam and all this kind of stuff. And uh, <laughs> all I kept doing was laughing and all this kind of stuff. But it released in July of 2022. I played it and I enjoyed it, but I was also a little bit disappointed. It was a factory game, but with no like metric data, like how fast this item goes out of this machine, this input for this machine, this output for this machine. But then it also had a story with sparks and all this kind of stuff. And it had a beautiful, you know, indoor uh, cavern feel and indoor cave kind of uh, feeling. But then it, it, with the metrics not being in there, I feel like it was very, a, be a very big feature that was overlooked to not release with it still confuses me to this day why it wasn't and i feel like it was a big oversight because when i saw that and i stated on the live stream i was like if this doesn't get added in soon like i feel like what's my goal what do i do and it was it was weird it was is it, it was a weird time um so i was like okay i just brushed it off we'll continue playing and then yes they brought in the metric system after many many feedbacks uh and we then give it another go. We did give it another chance and all this kind of stuff. And then I was enjoying it, playing it. Took a little break, come back with another update. I worked with the team on a, a sponsored video and all this kind of stuff. And then the update four, four come out, um, which was the new game mods. And then I was looking at this and I was like, okay, this is, this is all right. But... I feel like the main quest is that like all that stuff was a side quest, but I'm not seeing much attention on to the main quest. Like, I don't know if they're just throwing loads of like, they've got many, many different teams and they're just throwing this in there, this in there, this in there. Okay, this is version four, bam, deliver. This, 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 and this, and this, put it into this basket, deliver, that's patch six, da, 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 da seven. Uh, but I feel like if the if that's the way that's being done, I feel like that could be a bit bad for them. As we know, like I'm not just speaking this as a new player to factory games or all that kind of stuff. Like we got we got we play many many factory games. So like so do you guys. But this is just coming from me from an outside outside perspective, and what I'm seeing and what you guys are commenting as well and telling me about is it just doesn't work in the format it's working. Like, I have big hopes for the story and all this kind of stuff. But, like, delivering the game modes, I feel like, is a side quest, like I said. And it shouldn't have been delivered yet. And all these game modes, like, big heads. Uh, and then what else, what else was... I don't have any notes. Like, I'm I'm, I'm not done much, much research on this. Like I said, straight outside thoughts on this. Um... And then a no dismantle game mode and it's it was just confusing to me of why that was delivered i feel like that is after 1.0 kind of features and the way i'm seeing it is like like making a recipe making a meal for you and your family <laughs> i'm a big guy so i'm about to talk about food right so imagine making food but you put all the ingredients in at the wrong time and it tastes bad. Does that make sense? Um, that's how I'm kind of feeling about Tectonica at the minute. I feel like they need to sit around a table and go, this is how we make a curry. <laughs> this is going to get memed about so much. This is how we make it. This, this recipe, these are the steps we need to do. I feel like 
whoever's in charge over there at uh, Firehose Games, I don't know what they're doing because update five is just dropped as well and i've and i've literally just seen the trailer and this is why this video this video just popped up in my brain uh and it kind of hit the nail on the head for me this trailer basically i'm just gonna play you the trailer now all right and i'm so confused after watching this and here's why i think it's having a bit of an identity crisis so enjoy this video Feels like we're headed a long way down. So, this is where they were being kept. see what i mean like i don't know where it's meant to be i don't know if they're trying to show us fps stuff if it's trying to be the next call of duty i understand they're bringing light blocks in but laser games like laser tag <coughs> it's it's got me a little confused and this is why it's weird and i i really don't want this game to like do bad i want it to succeed like it's got so much potential but then i don't know who's making these decisions <laughs> like it's it's meant to be a factory game and I feel like we're straying away from that because my ADHD brain was going wild over that video. And yeah, like you can see how weird and confused I am. And I've said that a lot. And it's, it just needs organizing. Like if any of the developers want to reach out and have just have a chat, I'm more than happy to. Um, I really want this game to succeed, but the past recent updates, I'm just not seeing where it's going. I feel like it's, they're, they're just, it's, it's just filling, like, there's too much fat and it needs trimming. I'm not talking about me, I'm, I'm talking about the game. <laughs> but, like, it just needs trimming a little bit. There's unnecessary stuff, I feel like, is being added when the primary focus is to be a factory and automation game. Like, they're straying away from it, and I, I don't like it. And I don't like it. So, I don't know if they're just releasing updates just to get them out to people to keep a, to keep kind of relevant. I, I don't think they need to do that, if that's the kind of case. I, I feel like, focus on, like, prim primarily the progression and the story and that and then just release that in update even if it's one or just a mate two major updates within a year or one major update a year uh, and it just be a full action pack kind of big update instead of releasing you know this update then and then one down two months down the line or six months down the line kind of feel i feel like they're just throwing stuff here have 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 this treat have this treat have this treat have this treat and it's just not working for me. Uh, and like I said, it's all my own opinion. I want you two guys to let me know in the comments what you guys think as well. Uh, I'll love to read them and I'll, I'll answer it as many as you can. But I'm confused. And I feel like to answer most of your questions, I'm going to hold off just for now. I want to see what's going to happen. And we'll take it from there. So I appreciate you watching. Here's just a random video. And... Keep smiling and I'll see you.
in another video.